2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Happy to have you with us for NBA Basketball on 2K Sports. I'm Brian Anderson, alongside Grant Hill, Steve Smith, and Allie LaForce. And now the opening lineup for Chicago. Kobe White out there with Alex Caruso. Then it's DeMar DeRozan. Then there's Zach Levine. And it's Vucevic in at the center position, filling out the middle. And for Cleveland, and a lot of size for him, with both Mobley and Allen watching the paint. Garland runs point with Mitchell at the two. And it's Struess in at the three slot. Well, we've got some explosive athletes out here tonight, Grant, and front row seats to watch it. You know, B.A., they're going to be stuffing that highlight reel all night. I mean, you can feel the energy in this place. The crowd is definitely ready for it. Now here's Caruso. Who poked away. Stolen by Struess. And pushing it up. Here's Cleveland. Here's Mitchell. Drains the jumper to finish off the break. He can get that shot anytime he wants because of his ability to blow by you. Donovan gets you on your heels, and he stops and pops. Here's White. Three-pointer. Mobley grabs the board. Now here's Mitchell. Out left to the wing. Outside Garland. On the wing, Struess. Let's it go from deep. Out to Garland. From outside the arc. Counted from distance. When Garland finds a three-point shot, he takes it. Supremely confident in his abilities. Here's White. Pass to Caruso. The rebound by Allen. He is so good attacking the rim. It's rare to see him denied like that. Smitty, ever since the Rose and Butler era came to an end, the Bulls have lacked stability. You're so right, B.A. They have filtered through coaches. They've had high draft picks come and go, even acquired all-star players, but they're still searching for consistent success. Free throw good from Allen. I like that Allen plays with attitude. He's got a competitive streak, and it blends so well with his natural athletic ability. White, the pass to Caruso. They need this. And count the basket. He was fouled, and he's going to the line for one more. Well, Smitty, one of the league's stingiest wing defenders, Alex Caruso. And his motor makes him a fan favorite. B.A., sometimes a player comes around and he just vibes with the fans. Caruso has been that guy in every city. Free throw, no good. I like how Alex Caruso gives his team an instant energy boost out on the floor. He's always working overtime. I'll tell you what, I think he thought that was going in. I sure did. Oh, he missed that one. One for three in this one so far. The Cavaliers have gone three of five here in the opening quarter. Here's Mitchell and Vucevic with the block. Vucevic is so long, he's tough to get a shot over. Here's Levine, and the 18-footer right on the mark. When he decides he wants to take it to the bucket, it's really hard for anyone to slow him down. Mitchell feeling it out a bit. Pass to Mobley. Outside for Mitchell. Clock at six. Pure from three-point range. Mitchell's got five. Love the assertiveness from Donovan Mitchell. It's what makes him such a deadly scorer. Down low. And it's Vucevic. That time on the assist by Caruso. And setting the tempo with an assertive move. Like, 
Where was the defense on that play? No excuse. You have to be aware. He should be on your radar all the time. Inside, Garland outplays his size, using speed and agility to get it done. Pass to Levine. Driving in. Up top, Vucevic. Uncovered. The Cavaliers pull it in. Everything worked except for the outcome. You want him to shoot that every time. Levine with room to shoot. And buries the jumper to finish off the break. Levine's gotten his second bucket of the game. Active hands. Alex disrupts the play and gets his team in transition. Allen outside. Vucevic with a steal. Caruso against Mitchell. A minute 50 left to play in the first. And DeRozan, here we go. Well, some have called DeMar DeRozan a master of the mid-range, Smitty. Maybe rightly so. B.A., I definitely give him that title. Few guys are as efficient in that area as him. In fact, most avoid it. First free throw is good. Drafted back in 09, DeMar DeRozan continues to play at a high level. He's not slowing down at all. And the Cavaliers going with a whole new group out there. So Chicago going with an almost entire new group here. Andre Drummond is checked in for Vucevic. Williams comes in for Zach Levine. Dasumu, he's checked in for Caruso. And it's Ball in for White. That one falls, so he hits both of them. 144 left in the first quarter of the game. Levert outside. Pass to Wade. Here's Merrill. Just four to shoot. And no good. Ooh, excellent D there from Ball. And it's Niang with the rebound. The Cavaliers leading. And the foul called on Karis Levert. That's his first foul. A great job to establish position and square up. One oh five left in the first quarter. Now here's Ball. He's closely guarded. Drummond. And it's going to be a three-second call. The Cavaliers have gone 5 of 9 from the floor. Here's Merrill, hounded by Ball. The Cavaliers again cannot hit. Hard to convert against that kind of defensive pressure. The rim protection at its finest. The result is the same whether you block the shot or simply change it. DeRozan for 3. Great positioning on the putback. Andre Drummond using his size and athleticism to create a scoring opportunity off the miss. Levert with the ball. He's scoreless. Six to shoot. To win the drought. The shot won't fall. And still a close game as the first quarter comes to a close. The Cavaliers on top. They lead by one. And we'll be back with you shortly. This has been a fairly close game through the first quarter. We'll see what happens here in the second. And taking a look at the Cavs' performance here, guys, what are your thoughts? 
Well, it's pretty obvious. I mean, cashing in on extra opportunities. That's how they built this early lead. You can do everything else right, but if you fail to take care of the defensive glass, you're killing your chances. And here are the Cavaliers now. Mitchell and Okoro, they're the wings. Marcus Morris out there with Evan Mobley. And it's Garland in at the point. That's the group for Cleveland getting going in the second. All he needed was a little separation. So effective. Oh, it cleared the path, put him in position for a prime time dunk. That's a big time move and a big time finish. Now here's White, still without a bucket. Goes back up. And Vucevic lays it up and in. Great positioning by Vucevic. Hustle points for the big man. Pass to Okoro. Ooh, Williams with the block. Levine surveys the D. Desumu on the wing. Garland against White. Tipped away. Back to Okoro. From deep, Mitchell. Oh, Mitchell with the smooth stroke from distance. And with players like Moran and Giannis last season getting undercut around the rim, would you support moving the charge circle out of foot, Grant? You know, B.A., that's a good idea. I mean, I don't see why not. The league wants more highlights and less injuries, so it seems to make a lot of sense to me. Here's Garland. After the basket by Chicago. And he lays it up and in. Garland's got seven points. Garland has clearly added some muscle over the years. He's looking more and more comfortable working through contact. And let's send it over to Ali LaForce. Hey, Brian, the Cavaliers have that banner from 2016. Donovan Mitchell said, quote, we want to bring another championship for this city. None of us are LeBron James, but we can do it as a group. Our goal is to win the title. The city has seen it once, and they'll hopefully see it again. Brian? Well, they are a team to be reckoned with for sure. Thanks, Allie. Now here's Garland. Seven points in the game. Clock at two. Morris can't hit. White against Garland. Now here's White. Tight defense on him. Nice D from Garland. Pass to Mobley. Here's Morris. And he comes up with a bucket. And it's a six-point Cavalier lead. He can do it off balance. Morris was hit there and knocked it through easily. The Sumu, the pass to White. And the rebound goes to the Cavaliers. Outside Garland. Here's Mitchell. Can't nail the jumper. The Bulls have gotten just two of six field goals to go in the second. White against Garland. To the middle. Mobley, no good. That could have been an easy pass and finish. Not really sure what went wrong. It started off looking good, but the timing was just a little off. And sometimes that's all it takes. Good work defensively by White. Chicago shooting around 39%. They'd like to get that higher. Pass to Williams. Driving inside to stop the drought. Oh, and Mobley with the block. To the paint. Here's Morris. Played it in with a nice timeout, touch timeout. off the window. I like seeing Marcus Morris mix it up inside. Showing he can be counted on down there. Chicago calls timeout. It's time to talk this over and try to put a stop to this run. Because right now, it feels like the pace is being dictated to them. They need to go back to playing their brand of basketball.
Allen, he's checked in for the Cavs. Lavert comes in for Mitchell. So Chicago going with an almost entire new group here. Andre Drummond is checked in for Nikola Vucevic. DeRozan comes in for Williams. Caruso, he's checked in for DeSumo. And it's Ball in for White. Now here's DeRozan. And Drummond with the jam. I mean, tremendous body control in the air. Andre with the easy catch and flush. Mobley against DeRozan. Levert outside. Six on the shot clock. Shoots over Caruso. The shot by Levert, no good. And here's Ball. He'll bring it up for Chicago. They trail by six. Moving it up. He goes up. Oh, now that's how you finish a break. Throw it down with force. And this kind of play is only going to grow their lead. Holding the other guys down on defense and converting on the turnover. Now here's Ball. Hasn't gotten one to fall yet. Here's DeRozan. DeMar gets by the defenders. That's DeRozan for you. Aggressive by nature. He's going to attack you every trip down. Here's Okoro. He's covered by Levine. Count it. And the Cavaliers lead by eight. Great job executing the offense. That pass on time and on point. Here's DeRozan. DeRozan getting his feet wet in the paint. That's all muscle memory for DeRozan. He's the king of the mid-range. Ball against Garland. Shoots over ball. No good from 18. And so it's Cleveland with a six-point lead at the close of the quarter. Just pounding the painted area. That's helped him build an advantage. We'll be back in a moment. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Good to see you back here on our halftime show. Well, actually, we can't see you, but you can see us, but you get it. Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, Shaquille O'Neal. You're watching the NBA on 2K Sports. The first quarter for the Cavaliers was fairly even. At one point, they were ahead by eight points. They took control in the second quarter, ending the half up by six. Kenny, what's your take on Cleveland so far? You know every team talks about playing unselfishly, and in the first half, it didn't look like Now, looks can be deceiving, but the assist totals back up what we saw. Looking at Chicago, Shaq, your thoughts? You know, they didn't play it too safe. They made some really nice shots. Those are some much needed points. Playing the game. As long as they stay on the same page and keep working together, they got a great chance to take control of this game. And now with the second half about to get underway, let's send you back courtside. See everybody with Kevin Harlan. Second half of basketball is upon us, and we may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game we've seen so far. We've seen Donovan Mitchell really having a great game. Through the first two quarters, he's been on fire. Explosive offensive performance. This is his challenge to continue to dominate, to help them try to close strong here in the second half. We've got second half action for you. And if the next couple of quarters are similar to the first, this one could go down to the last possession. Second half underway. Here's who Billy Donovan's got on the floor. They've got Nikola Vucevic, Zach Levine out there with DeMar DeRozan. Then it's Kobe White, and it's Caruso in at the two. What a feed by Donovan Mitchell, taking full advantage of the weakness in the defense. White, the pass to DeRozan. Tries again. Outside for Levine. Yes, great play by DeRozan to set him up. Levine's got seven points in the game. Wow, Zach with such focus. He feels good taking those corner shots. Allen, the pass to Garland. Can't hit that one. Good work defensively by White. Chicago trailing here. 
Caruso with the bucket. That's all focused by Alex Caruso, absorbing the contact and getting the finish. Garland looking around. The three is up. And it's Chicago with the board. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. And keeping us updated from the sideline, Ali LaForce. Well, Darius Garland has the talent to set the table and get his own. Coach Bickerstaff said, quote, Darius is really good first and foremost. He understands when it's time when we call his number and when it's time to get the other guys involved. We've been able to depend on him, and he's proven that the moment is never too big for him. Brian? All right, Allie, thank you for that. Good stuff. And there's a three-second violation. That's just being out of sync and at the worst time, costly. A different look for Cleveland. Niang, he's checked in for Evan Mobley. And it's Merrill in for Darius Garland. Williams is checked in for Chicago. The Sumu comes in for Levine. Here's the Sumu. Checked by Mitchell. The Sumu, the pass to Vucevic. Over Allen. Calls back and drains a fadeaway J. Six points for him. Most guys, Nicola's size, don't have this touch. But he can strike from mid-range. Mitchell, the pass to Allen. And here's Struess. Blocked! Here's Desumu. No points yet. Pass to Vucevic. Shoots over Allen. Vucevic's shot is off. Cleveland has gotten three of their seven threes to find the net in this matchup. The defense there doing whatever they can to protect the rim. One falls for him. So he gets them both. And that's what he does. Rock solid at the line. For Chicago, they've gotten three of six shots to fall so far in the third. The Sumu, the pass to White. Outside, Williams. The shot is good, and this game is back to even. Williams has got five points. Doesn't shoot often from deep, but Williams gives them the ability to use him from outside. Struess against Caruso. Shoots a fadeaway. That one rolls around and rims out. And even with the miss, that's a high percentage shot for him. What I appreciate about Patrick is that he plays his role well. Doesn't play outside of himself. Falls that puts him up one point in the game now. A different look for Cleveland. Wade comes in for Allen and Levert subbed in for Struess. Andre Drummond is checked in for Chicago. Ball comes in for White. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. The Cavaliers have gone only one for six here in the second half. Niang outside. Back to Wade. Williams grabs the board. There is the value of great rim protection without fouling, forcing the miss. Ball right side. Here's Drummond. And Drummond with the jam. 
The floor awareness of Ball excels at getting the ball to his uncovered teammates. Well, unfortunately for Lonzo Ball, he's had some real difficulty staying healthy, Smitty. B.A., you know it has to be frustrating for him. Everyone is hoping he'll find a way to turn things around and find a way to have a long career in this league. Well, coming in, you know Donovan Mitchell's going to get shots. All you can do defensively is try to make it tough on him. Now a timeout called by Chicago. He's checked in for Cleveland. Okoro comes in for Merrill. 136 left in the third quarter. Here's Desumu. He's checked by Levert. Ball outside. Back to Caruso. There's the triple. Sends it home from three-point land. Caruso's got seven. Alice Caruso's off-the-ball action is Excellent. From the left block. And the bucket by Levert. One minute left to play in the third quarter here. Pass to Williams. Drummond inside. Guarded by Morris. Caruso, the pass to Ball. And again, it's Chicago with a three. Reliable three-point shooting is so important. Lonzo works hard to deliver that for the team. And here's Levert for three. It's hauled in by the Bulls. Nine seconds separating the shot clock and game clock. And here's Ball. Pass to Drummond. Here's Desumu. That one's in there. Drummond with the assist. And it's an eight-point Chicago lead. This is why you're trying to get him as many touches as possible. He's got the deck. Gets the three ball to go. Mitchell's got five points now in the quarter. We've seen this before. Mitchell found his shooting rhythm and cannot be stopped. And we've reached the end of the third. It's the Bulls. They lead by five. And we're coming right back. Be sure to stay with us as we get set for quarter number four. All right, let's take a look at our assist of the game presented by State Farm. This is the definition of team chemistry. I love to see this kind of communication and connection between teammates leading to the perfect pass. Fundamental basketball. Keep your eyes up. Keep the ball moving. You're going to keep the defense on his heels. Three tenths quarters behind us. One more to go. Thanks for being with us as we get ready for the fourth. Garland runs point with Mitchell at the two. Mobley and Allen combo out front. And it's Struess and it's small forward. So that's who's on the floor for the Cavs. Maybe one of the best dunkers in the league. Zach Levine putting on a show for the fans. And here are the Cavaliers now. The Bulls making their last shot. Allen against Vucevic. Five on the clock. 
Tries it from 16, and he stays with it. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. White, he's checked in for ball. Chicago leading. Outside White. Pass to DeRozan. Oh, and Mobley with the block. Caruso against Mitchell. Now here's Allen. Vucevic with a steal. And here is DeRozan. Shoots over Mobley. And he can't bank that one in. I like it. That's a great battle at the rim. He just couldn't finish. And finished off by Garland. I mean, such an explosive play by Garland. Taking it right up for the slam. Timeout, Timeout called time here. Out. Chicago decides to talk it over. Let's check in with Allie LaForce. Thanks, guys. I got a chance to hear what Billy Donovan was saying to the team. Well, Coach is thrilled with their three-point shooting, saying in the huddle, guys, let's keep it up. Continue to shoot it from deep. It's working. They've been on fire from distance so far. Okay, thank you, Allie. Mitchell, the pass to Struess. Here's Garland. Up top, Allen. Shot clock at six. The shot from 20 feet out. And Garland with the basket on the assist by Allen. Garland's gotten four this quarter. Outside Levine. Fires from deep. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Mobley's got rebound number eight here already in the game. <laughs> and plays like that one can make the difference in a close game. And it definitely got the bench on their feet, too. This is a close-knit group. They feed off one another's energy. DeRozan looks it over. On the wing, Caruso. Oh, rejected by Allen. What a difference maker defensively. Allen just controlling the airspace. Garland, the pass to Mobley. On the wing, Mitchell. And he lobs it up. High value assist there. Finding him inside for the finish. The Bulls have got one out of six shots to fall in this final quarter. Not ideal. Levine finds White. Ooh, he can't stop the run as that misses. And so it's Garland who brings up the ball for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Time a out, great fourth out. quarter. Just giving up two points. This just goes with the narrative. Mitchell is a baller, wants to be considered among the best in the game. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. There's no way Coach likes this effort level. They need to refocus. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive.
And now let's take a look at the New Balance player of the game, Donovan Mitchell. <laughs> He's been unguardable in this one, getting whatever he wants out there. He's just simply putting the offense on his back and delivering. Chicago has gone four of eight from three, a nice percentage. Levine passes to White. Caruso outside. Back to White to halt the run. Cavaliers with a rebound. Down low. Here's Garland. Outside Mitchell. Mitchell bullies his way inside. You gotta love how fearless Donovan Mitchell is. He's remarkable at absorbing contact while shooting. And it's DeRozan missing. The other team just looks more in sync and is riding the momentum. You know what? This has always been a debate. Do you take the time out or do you let your guys try to fight through it? Now here's Mobley. Back to Garland. Clock at six. Allen on the wing. Covered by Vucevic. Allen can't get it to go. Chicago's gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. Pass to Vucevic. Here's DeRozan. Yes! And the foul! It's going to be Evan Mobley. DeRozan simply rises to the occasion with that make. Huge shot. All right, guys, some stats here. The scoring breakdown for the Cavaliers. Smart ball handling from them in this one. Passing around to get ahead of the defense and putting it in the hands of ready shooters. Yeah, another thing, this offense came in aggressive. Driving into the lane, forcing the defense to try to adjust. So far, the defense hasn't had enough of an answer. No doubt about those free throws. This is why you put the ball in his hands. Mitchell against Caruso. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket is good, and he'll go to the line. The youngster is not going to buckle or fold. Donovan Mitchell is not afraid of the moment. Free throw is good for Mitchell. The and one puts a little extra insurance on their lead. What a play. Chicago has gone four of nine so far from the perimeter. 52 seconds left in the fourth quarter. DeRozan passes to Levine. Oh, he nails it! And he's brought them within two points now. You expect he's going to find a way to pull through in the clutch. They'll probably slow things down now. Burn the clock while you have the lead. I like that. Mitchell, the pass to Mobley. Out to the right wing. White against Garland. And it's blocked by Vucevic. And the Bulls call time here. They're down by two. We've got 22 seconds left in the fourth quarter.
They've been keeping things close. And now have a chance to jump back on top, B.A. Here's DeRozan. Ooh, offline! And an intentional foul right there. And a smart choice right there. I mean, you can't allow them to just drain the clock. Good on the first, and that makes it a three-point lead. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a four-point ball game. Taking care of business at the line, leaving this one out of reach. Caruso up top. White for three. Count it! Oh, time out, time what a out. sensational bucket! That brings him within one. Alex Caruso, he can make that pass in his sleep. Timeout call, the Cavaliers. They're leading by one. Five ticks left in the fourth quarter. left in the fourth quarter here and they stop the clock as soon as they can with the intentional foul he drops the first one and that'll put him up too. Garland has a scorer's mentality from the field and from the line. So he gets them both. And it's a three-point game. You have to admire how calm he is under pressure at the free throw line in a key situation. It's all about getting a three right here. When they're looking to tie it up, live to play another period. We'll see what they run right here. And so it's the Cavaliers who come out on top. That was an incredible night of hoops. A tremendous finish. They waited until the very last moment to seal it. And so many times we see these close games won by the home team. And that about wraps it up. For Steve Smith, Grant Hill, and Ali LaForce, I'm Brian Anderson. Thank you for watching this 2K Sports coverage of the NBA. We'll see you next time.